What's good, guys? If you're looking for cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure I head over my sponsor. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout for the most cheapest, most fastest, most quickest, reliable. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K22 My Team video. And guys, today we are going over the market in NBA 2K22 My Team. So, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to sub it up, comment down below, guys. We got more super packs, guys. 2K's really trying to make that cash money. Um, wow, the, this this super pack has a lot of players in it. But, like, why would you ever want to open up the Super Pack if there's only two Dark Matters in it and Opals that aren't that expensive? So, that's the first thing that comes to mind when I see this. It's just 110% not worth it. These Super Packs are literally a scam. 11,000 MT per pack. The only good players really are Giannis, obviously, Luka, and Curry. So, these packs are just not worth it. You're not going to make a lot of MT off these packs. They are a little on the cheaper side, but do not pop those. If I was going to pop any packs... Honestly, it'd probably be this one, but that's not even that good either. So I would just wait for the new content on Friday. Um, obviously, Yas and Jordan cool. You're probably not gonna pull them, and AD and Demar cool. But chances are, you're just gonna get a pink diamond. So try to stay away from the packs. I do recommend that. If you guys are new, sub it up. If you guys do need MT, hit me up. I am buying and selling MT on all consoles. So if you guys do need MT, make sure to hit me up. I am buying and selling on all consoles. So you hit me up on Instagram and or Twitter. But Let's take a look at the market, see what's going on. As you guys know, I stepped out a couple opals the last couple days. See what's going on with the pink diamonds. If people actually do pop these packs, these pink diamonds will fall crazily down in price. But as you can see, man, not a lot of people are popping these packs. Um, these pink diamonds are already non-rare whatsoever, especially all these dynamic rating cards. They're super not rare whatsoever. So if you see these pink diamonds at around 4K, it means the market's not crashing. It's going to be way harder to snipe and way harder to make MT. So that's step number one. Dynamic ratings, you stay away from them. You will not make MT with them. You will just lose your MT. So yeah, as of right now, the market is clearly, clearly super high. So what you should do is try to snipe out opals. Ooh, I like this one. Um, you should really definitely snipe out opals. I think it's a good idea. Um, opals will go up in value, especially some of these players, but dynamic ratings is not it. Stay away from every single dynamic ratings player. You will not make MT. You will simply lose MT so quickly, and I just do not recommend it. But yeah, right now the market is super dry. If you do have a stack squadron, you should probably sell your team. These super packs are not it. People are not popping these super packs. They're an absolute waste of MT. They're an absolute waste of money. They're an absolute waste of VC. So if people are popping these super packs, you guys are crazy. I would never pop these super packs. They're not worth it. They should crash the market if there was more dark matters in it. But there's no dark matters in it. There's two dark matters. So what kind of super pack is that? When all you're pulling is rubies and amethyst, it makes no sense. Right now, to make MT, you literally just have to sell your squad. It is the easiest, most simplest way to make MT right now in this game. It is so, and when I mean so, it is so simple to make MT right now in NBA 2K22. So yeah, definitely do that. Let me know if it works. There's really nothing else I have to talk about right now. Honestly, there's just nothing else. But yeah, that's all we got for the vid. Hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Peace.